Now, a lot of people are interested in the link between happiness and money. And my daughter Louise has got a really interesting tip that I thought would be worth sharing with you all about how she manages to get a bit more happiness with, paradoxically, a bit less money. So tell us about that one, Louise. So all the videos I've been doing for this channel have been about freedom. And this one for me is about financial freedom. And when I first became a digital nomad, I moved to Thailand with absolutely no income source or plans. And the reason I was able to do that was because I had like 5,000 pounds of savings. So I had this real safety buffer. So I knew if it took me a while to find an online job, it was possible. And having those savings totally changed my life because it meant I could move to Thailand. And now I've been traveling full time for like six years with an online income I never could have dreamed of. And so having those savings was really important to me. And the way that I got those savings is that every day, um, obviously you're trying to save money all the time, but I try and save money in comparison to whoever I'm with. Right. So I have a few friends who are a little bit spendy, they might even watch this and not know who they are. Um, and just when I spend the day with them, I try and spend five pounds less than them. Five pounds less than <laughs> them. But, but you've got to pay your share. Yeah, totally. The middle or the round or something yeah. like that. So you still, you know, pay halves or whatever, but yeah. if we go for a coffee or if we go for dinner, I won't have a drink, I'll just have water. And they'll have a glass of wine and I'm like, yes, five pounds. Or, um, or if you're out shopping or something. Yeah, if we're out shopping, they'll buy something off the sale rack, which they're never gonna wear and I don't buy anything. And I'm like, yes, five pounds. Um, or they'll suggest we meet somewhere, they'll get a taxi, I'll get the bus or I'll walk or I'll get a lift from my mum. <laughs> um, and I think like, yes, five pounds. And so it's great to save just against yourself. But for me, it really helps to save against someone else. So competitive. <laughs> Uh, but yeah. five pounds a day times you know 350 days a year is thousands of pounds and so you can have an amazing holiday on that or you can use it to quit your job and be able to go freelance because you have a month's salary yeah. in the bank that you can yeah. play with so i think five pounds a day can be a really life-changing amount and it's a fun little game that you can play with yourself until this video i don't think they even know that i play it well, they do now. So anyway, thank you for that, Louise. Continue with your traveling life. She's off to Australia in a few days' time. It's all right for some, but remember, you could do it. So check out her channel as well, which is called Digital Nomad Girl. It's on YouTube, and you can learn about how you too could be a digital nomad if you want to be.